The Jake Paul vs Mike Tyson fight was absolutely wild. A fight between a 27 year old and a 58 year old man was really only ever going to end up one way, and end up with Jake winning, it did. Of course, there has been much controversy and drama surrounding the lead up to the fight, with many criticising Jake for deciding he wanted to fight a man who could be old enough to be his father, but it's clear Mike wanted it too and decided to go ahead with it. After all, Jake was slated to receive $40 million, and Tyson $20 million, so man, I reckon I'd get in the ring for that much too, even if I ended up looking like an idiot. The weird part is that so many were keen for Tyson to put Jake in his place, despite his old age, and that is exactly what Netflix and all those involved were banking on. Jake describes himself as the problem child, so he knows his role is to play the villain in boxing, and it's extremely likely that he and Tyson discussed the idea of putting on the exhibition to earn the big bucks, and it totally worked. Millions of memes and references to the fight have been going on since it was announced, and since then the internet has been waiting with bated breath for the outcome. Of course, the actual event wasn't without controversy too. From Tyson slapping Jake in the face, to butt shots, to Netflix consistently dropping out and buffering during the fight due to huge amounts of traffic, and of course, a suspension for both fighters at the end. And yet, there's something magical about such a violently ridiculous event. It was fun to watch the two of them tell each other they'd be dead. It was fun to watch the insane announcers talk about boxing history as if this is all very serious. And it was fun to know that millions of people were all tuning in at the same time, hopeful to see Paul get rocked. It didn't lead to the explosive KO event that both fighters promised, but that doesn't really matter. What does matter is that nothing is sacred anymore as long as there's enough money going around to fund it, and enough people to watch it, so really anything is possible. In short, Jake knows that this is his in to the big leagues. He just has to keep making people hate him enough to want to see him put in his place, and he'll continue to earn huge dollars. At the end of the day, this is enough to fuel an onslaught of memes and speculation referencing each fight, ensuring the new norm of exhibition matches becomes the dominant form of boxing entertainment. What meme would you guys like me to give a lesson in next? Let me know in the comments below. And remember, like and subscribe! <laughs>